Hi guys! So I finally have the long overdue video that I had promised a very long time ago for you guys. It's the DIY photo letters, the ones I had on my wall. Um, I know a few of you had asked me how I had done my wall, insert a few pictures here. I had actually done a periscope over the summer and I told you guys that I would upload that, but that never happened, caught up with school, and I finally had the chance to sit down and film the video. If there's any confusion or if you have any questions, just feel free to leave a comment down below. Any questions on Twitter, ask any questions on Instagram, wherever you have any questions or something that may confuse you, go ahead and ask me. Um, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Thank you guys for watching. Let's get started. The first thing you're going to need is some pictures, a cutting board or any surface that you can cut on, a sponge or a brush, whichever you prefer, a wooden letter, some scissors, an X-Acto knife or a box cutter, and some Mod Podge of your preference. So the first thing you're going to do is start arranging all the pictures on top of the letter, however you would like them to be placed. Uh, try to see where the edge of the letter is so you make sure that you don't cut uh, parts of the picture that you wish to not cut. As you can see I kind of bent over the edges of the letter to see how they would fit. So just arrange them however you would like and just a tip before you start this project when you're printing out your pictures at the store or wherever you wanted to print them out um, try to think of the shape of your letter so for example I have an R so it is longer portrait wise and the, the, the sides are a lot slimmer. So try to print out pictures that are more portrait size and that they're a little bit smaller so that they fit on the sides of it um, in, instead of um, landscape pictures. So just shape them however you would like to. Now the next thing you're going to do is place Mod Podge under the pictures. You can take them all off or you can lift them up one by one as I did. I think it's easier to lift them up one by one than to take them all off because then you forget how you want them to be placed. Um, you, this also gives you a little bit of room to move them around a little bit if you didn't like the way you had placed them. So just place one layer of Mod Podge under so it'll glue down to the surface. When you have finished gluing down all of the pictures on the letter, let them dry completely before you flip them over. Now that you have flipped the letter over, go ahead and start cutting off all of the excess of the pictures with the exacto knife or box cutter or whatever utensil you are using to cut. So try to cut as close to the edge, but also be careful because you could be cutting off portions of the wooden letter. Grab your sponge or your brush or whatever you're using again and dip it into the Mod Podge and put another layer of the Mod Podge on top of the letter to seal um, the pictures on the letter and to glue them completely. And once you're done with that, go ahead and let the letter dry completely and you should be finished. This is the finished pro product. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and thank you guys for watching. Also, before I forget, if you have anything that you would like me to try out, like if there's any DIYs that you don't know, that you don't think you could do, but you really want to know how to do, maybe I could try them out. And um, if you have like any video suggestions, um, it might take me a while to film them, but um, I'll still give it a shot. Or if you've seen anything else that I've done that you would like me to do, feel free to leave that down in the comment section or just at me on Twitter, like I said. Alright, thank you guys. Bye!